Welcome back to my channel, Divine Timeless Cosmic Tarot. <laughs> if this is your first time coming across the platform, let me be the first to say that I'm just glad that you're here. I'm glad you stopped scrolling. I hope that you will stay a while, catch these high vibes, and, you know, take what resonates, right? Maybe you'll decide to like, love, share, comment, and or subscribe in that order or maybe not whatever you decide to do guess what i support you in the energy welcome to spiritual court it's a place where things get ironed out baby laid out exposed made transparent where we keep it real we keep it a buck in spiritual court this could be the past the present and or the future by way of um the timeline is that what i was gonna say yeah the timeline that you're on or the one that you're mastering, right? Let's just be real. Hopefully you're adhering to your higher self. That is my hope for you. Again, my spiritual disclaimer to you is one, I am here to give you the messages. Two, don't shoot if you get triggered. Three, I encourage you to be overly meditated and or prayed up about any given situation before you come into this reading and any other readings. That is my recommendation. And four, I support the energy. Okay, needless to say, if you're returning back to the channel, you are my beautiful, amazing, beautiful soul tribe family. I love you. I always got to give y'all a special shout out because I just love you so much. I do. We're just going to dive right on in my beautiful, amazing soul tribe. Love. I'm gonna take the Louisiana card and burn it. If this card comes up one more time, this is how I feel the universe feels. If we got to warn you one more time over whatever you think you're doing that nobody sees, it's 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 gonna listen, it's gonna be more than just smoke in the city, my love. It's gonna be smoke in the city, and like you bring in hellfire to the city, man. The lake of fire. Don't trust this person. It's a fake ass offer. Who is this fake ass, phony ass, phony ass, baloney ass person where hate is eating them up? Okay. This is hate is eating this person from the inside out. It could be causing them bad health. Yes. Stress kills. Somebody stressed out over you. The fact that you won't take a false offer. Louisiana is coming up again. This could be real significant. Child, let's get into this reading and see what is going on. Beautiful angels, my beautiful spirit team, high vibrational beings that assist me every day so that I can channel these energies. So says source, please grant me permission as I am grounded here in the 3D and I levitate and or gravitate to the 5D and above to open up these apostolic realms. I'm calling upon higher knowledge, higher, ooh, my left ear is ringing already. God diggity dog. What is going on? Something is going on in the ethers. Whatever it is, it's all bad for somebody. Hate is eating this person from the inside out. They could be getting sick. Don't trust this person. It's a fake ass offer. Clarify what's going on. Show us this person. Why are my ears ringing? What's going on, spirit? Yeah, somebody's sneaking in, doggone deceptive. Seven of swords sneaking around trying to be in your energy. And they ass is getting caught by some type of supernatural beings. Child, somebody don't want to mess with you. I don't know what the hell they thought, okay? Whatever they conjuring up, it's a wrap. Four of pentacles, they can't hold on to something that belongs to you. This could be energy. This could be a way of thinking. You know, sometimes people hold a certain mindset, uh, an idea of you in their mind's eye based on what it is they want to manifest. They can't hold on to a damn thing as it relates to you. I can't make this up. Three of pentacles in the reverse. Somebody is looking real dumb right now. Three of pentacles in the reverse is some type of collaboration that's falling apart with the four of pentacles. Three, four. Somebody has to let something go, walk away, abandon it. Somebody's in bad health because of hatred, stress, okay? 
Oh, Spirit is saying it's not even the magic that's killing them. It's the fact that they lost and they're angry about it. That's eating them up from the inside out. Three of Pentacles in the reverse is a bad collaboration. Seven of Swords, they're still trying to do something. Even after things are, are like, it's obvious that things are falling apart. Clarify, don't trust this person. It's a fake offer. Who is this person? It's the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Energy. Somebody is saying it's not over till I say it's over. They don't want a cycle to be closed out to their own detriment, child. King of Pentacles. Somebody could, uh, I don't know who this person is. King of Pentacles. Somebody's saying that something's not over. Or you could be the King of Pentacles. Who's this King of Pentacles? Somebody that you don't want to mess with is what I just heard. The Hierophant. The King of Pentacles is a Hierophant. Somebody that understands how you're learning. Yeah, they not no joke. Justice, Libra and energy. Damn, who is this person? Queen of Swords energy. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Big Libra and energy. Hierophant energy. Taurus energy. Giving Empress energy. Somebody's a Libra. Somebody's birthday could be, uh, what is this? What am I getting? Mm, 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 mm. Somebody's birthday could be in September. It's very possible. Who is this King of Swords? Oh, why did I say King of Swords? I meant to say Queen of Swords. King of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. Okay, Justice, the Hierophant from Louisiana. Who are these people? Who are these people? Somebody that's going to be communicating with you. Somebody that's sending you a lot of psychic attacks. Somebody not to be messed with. Five of Swords. They're coming up as somebody very well respected in the spiritual community. Five of Swords. They're sending you some type of spiritual conflict. Okay? This could be... Um, I just heard a husband and wife. Okay? Clarify, don't trust this person. It's a fake offer. How are they connected to these people? Yeah, this is somebody that's going to get divination. Okay? Okay? This king of pentacles and or queen of swords is a couple that could be doing some type of divination on you or they're watching you or they're getting information about you. Okay, sometimes uh, sometimes people are like led to the slaughter without their knowledge. They're so smart, they're stupid. This is what spirit is saying. It's 444 four, four on the clock. Okay, sometimes people are so smart, they're like idiot savants. That's what I get from this couple. They're so smart, they're so knowledgeable with the Hierophant energy that they're dumb as shit. Because they still didn't see who you were, even after doing divination. Somebody is like a fake offer. Who's this sneaky person? Somebody's working with somebody. And they could be trying to get close to you. Capricorn energy, the devil in the reverse. Okay, this could be somebody collaborating with somebody. The devil, Capricorn energy. Yeah. Somebody is like, how can they be doing divination, not seeing who you are? They're so they're so smart, they're dumb. Like, how you that damn smart that you dumb? This is what happens when people learn so much, and then they're like, okay, I know enough. I'm I'm, I'm I can do this now, right? These people are high rank though. I ain't gonna lie. They know a lot about spirituality, working with spirits, deities, elements, the moon, yada, yada. But when you put a limit on your knowledge, this is when you outsmart yourself. Somebody felt like they knew it all. You never know it all. There's always something to learn because energy is forever being, you know, uh, co-created by source and energies. Nothing is finite. And I see very finite energy, like, oh yeah, we powerful, we got it, this is it. But somebody couldn't see beyond their own ego, beyond their own idiot savantness, is what my spirit team said. My spirit team is funny as shit. Okay, that's all I was saying. My spirit team is funny as shit. My spirit team. Somebody could be listening. Clarify the page of sources. My back here is ringing, child. Yeah, four swords in the reverse. This shit is not turning out well for somebody. Hate is eating this person alive. It's causing them bad health. Four of swords in the reverse. Libra and energy. The devil in the reverse. Four of pentacles in the reverse. They can't hold on to your energy. Three of pentacles in the reverse. Bad collaboration. Who's the third person that was collaborating with this king of pentacles and this queen of swords? These people got a lot of money. They made a lot of money doing spell work. I don't know. But whoever this person is that was working with them, they're way down. Because they were under some type of an illusion with limited information, limited knowledge. 
Somebody thought they knew so much that they could do anything and they came for somebody that's a being that you can't be touched. Ten of Wands, this person stressed out. Seven of Cups because they were under some type of an illusion. This is the third party, which leads me to believe that this is the client that went to this couple. Okay, clarify Louisiana, what's going on? What happened? What happened in Louisiana? The truth is coming out. The ancestors are walking through the bayou, walking through New Orleans, walking through the whole state of Louisiana with the truth. The Ace of Swords represents Archangel Michael energy. Justice is about to be served. Clarify why my left ear is ringing. I feel like they're talking about you. Yeah, they're talking about you and they're getting bad luck. The will has not, you know, turned in their favor. The scales are not like tilting. I don't know why I said skipping. I want to say skipping in their favor. They're trying to skip over some type of bad karma, trying to figure out how to get away from it. What is this energy that I'm hearing? What is this energy that I'm feeling? What is this? Don't trust this person. Fake offer. They're really upset. Yeah, this person is trying to come in. Somebody is finding out that you're winning. That you have a victory. Aries energy. Somebody could be a fire sign. Somebody could be a Leo. Whatever this is. Or you have it highly aspected in your chart. Or you're just in your fire sign energy. You could be a water sign in your fire sign energy. Yeah, four of wands and a six of wands. Somebody is pissed off that this door is opening, that they're being exposed, that the truth is coming out, that you know that they're sneaky and deceptive and that something has gone like crazy. Somebody regrets getting into a collaboration with these practitioners, okay? Four of wands and a six of wands. Somebody could be trying to come in with a fake offer. Clarify what's going on. Things are being made illuminated. What's going on with this four of wands and a six of wands? Yeah, child, somebody's trying to bind you. Somebody was either trying to bind themselves to your soulmate contract to have it for themselves, or there's a lover coming in with a fake offer that was trying to bind you. Somebody is, uh, yeah, somebody was projecting illusions. Yeah, page of wands. What is this? And the two of cups. I can't make this up. Page of wands and the two of cups. Gathering information about your partnership. Somebody could be getting a reading on you to see if you're still with your person or if you're going towards your person. Yeah, I can't make this up. I feel like whoever you are, you've already like taken a leap of faith into your future, your destiny. So whatever information these people are getting is outdated. <laughs> oh shit, this shit is funny. It's outdated in real time is what I just heard. So somebody could be seen with the practitioner, they're getting information, but it's outdated information in real time. I can't make this up. It's almost like these people are like, like getting old information and they're the last to know that they've been defeated with the five of wands and the reverse. Child, this has got to be a joke. This is hilarious. Somebody's getting outdated information about your situation and your circumstance unbeknownst to them that what they're finding out about you is outdated. They could have been tapped into an old lifetime timeline because in this lifetime, you're coming up as somebody very high ranked. Yeah, look, these people are communicating with the dead. Necromancy could have gone to a graveyard. Five of wands. These people thought that you were gone or dead or what the hell they thought? Clarify the five of wands in the dead. Somebody could have been trying to take a, a, a trip towards you to hurt you. Okay, over some weird stuff just because they couldn't take you out on an energetic level. Yeah, I can't make this up. I can't make this up. You're coming up as the Empress energy, divine feminine energy, Taurus, Libra energy, balanced, poised, very, 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 uh, you know, very, very much kept together. Clarify who this uh, King of Pentacles and this Queen of Swords is. Who are these people? Yeah, the Seven of Wands, big Leo energy. Somebody's birthday could be in August. Clarify the Seven of Wands. Who is this person? Or somebody could be a Virgo. What's going on here? A Virgo Libra? Yeah, it's over. Somebody is finding out that you're not grieving. Five of Cups, the loss of something. Maybe something connected to them. How does this person know the Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine? What is their position? Who is this person? Six of Pentacles. This is somebody that came in like they're coming to give you something and it's fair. But Spirit is saying, don't trust this person. Six of Pentacles. This is a fake-ass offer. Who is this person? Yeah, this is an emperor. Somebody knows that you have somebody coming in. The emperor to the empress. 
Equal give and take. Don't trust this offer. Yep, it's a fake ass offer. Ace of Wands in the reverse. Mm mm, mm mm. This person has fallen from grace. They're cursed. They're cursed. Will of Fortune in the reverse. They get nothing but bad karma for some shit that they did. They're weighed down. They were under this illusion that this couple was going to be able to bring you back because these people are so knowledgeable with the Hierophant about magic or something justice is here balance is being restored the devil is in the reverse you have broken free from some shit that tried to hold on to you or entity attachment or somebody wanted to attach themselves to you with the eight of swords bind themselves now the truth is out and louisiana is under judgment somebody's playing in the graveyard four pentacles in the reverse this person can't hold on to you and the fact it's almost like somebody is dying angry like, it's almost like the hate is eating them up literally from the inside out, causing bad health. Somebody is livid. Somebody is seething. Somebody is feeling insidious to the highest point of feeling insidious. Listen, they are pissed off to the highest point of insidity. They're yeah, look, this is somebody that was coming in to take you out, honey. This, this was somebody that was a slow moving energy, very patient, very methodical. Nine of Pentacles is slow moving, working solo, dolo, this is a spiritual hitman. Ten of Swords. So I guess the goal was to get you to come back to them, okay? Whoever this person is, or to come towards them. If this is somebody that you've never met or somebody that you don't know, the goal was to get you to put down your guard, let down your guard, so this person could come in and basically take you out. Ace of Wands in the reverse, baby, this is not a real offer. This is not your divine person. Page of Wands, somebody knows about your destiny. Somebody t tried to tap into your Akashic records, but I heard the, the energy and or the information that they had was outdated. Because somebody would not have come at you like this had they known who you were. Somebody needs to know you've ascended beyond these illusions. You see this shit coming a mile away. The Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Child lightning is about to strike these people. Clarify this Queen of Swords and this King of Pentacles, this Hierophant, the practitioners. Yeah, Queen of Wands. It's a witch out here. I told you somebody's birthday is in August. Somebody's birthday could be in April, August, okay, or December. Uh-huh. Big December energy with the Capricorns. Is a December Capricorn. Or this is the third party. This is the client that went to these people. Why is Louisiana significant? Somebody could be from there or they travel to there. Yeah, they went there. I can't make it up. Look at the Three of Wands. Look at this person going on a journey. Three of Wands. Somebody took a trip to Louisiana to have somebody do something. Clarify the trip. What happened? It's the King of Wands. King of Wands to the Queen of Wands. Big Sagittarius energy with the Ten of Wands there. Could be a fire sign. Could be two fire signs. Could be a couple that went to see a couple. Okay. Big Aries energy too. Clarify what's going on, Spirit. What happened? They went to Louisiana. What did they want? To destroy you. To take you down. Break your heart. Take your manifestations, devour your heart, consume your heart. Somebody's got a door open. Clarify my ears, thinking what's going on. Yeah, somebody's losing their gifts. I can't make the shit up. Somebody's under judgment. Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Losing their spiritual gifts for trying to take your gifts. You're in your Ten of Pentacles and somebody's ass is under judgment and death. The judgment card fell up right on top of the Ten of Swords and death. Somebody landed on their own sword. Somebody dug a grave and they're now having to rot in it. And they're in bad health with the four swords in the reverse. I can't make it up. The tower. <sighs> Child. Meanwhile, righteous justice and judgment is being served. I'm about to make me some um. I just had to have a commercial break because this is this is so this is some bullshit. Okay. Uh, look at what's underneath here. Blood sacrifice. Sacrificing the livelihoods of others for personal gain. Making deals with the devil. Making deals with the elite for fame, success, fortune, money, and clout. Child, somebody's ass is crazy. It's, it deals with the devil. I can't make this up. Mm -mm -mm. What am I about to make me, y'all? I think I'm going to make me some fried rice with brown rice. No eggs. Extra green onion, though. You know what I'm saying? And even though I know I'm not supposed to eat soy sauce, I'm going to put a little soy sauce, okay? I know soy sauce. People are like, oh my God, soy sauce. Well, me and my body, we don't believe that. And so that shit don't hurt us. Okay, that's how I like. 
I got time. You can, you got so much information you can take in out here. Don't drive yourself crazy. Decide what you want to believe and believe that and keep it going. Hopefully it's something positive. Hopefully it's something good. Which leads me to my next beautiful commercial break. Join me on my other platform. <laughs> where we're absolutely having a really good time healing lives of positivity 24-7, 365, 365, 24-7. Listen, we just have real conversations. It's conversations with Nev. I do a little storytelling. I tell you a little bit about my background. We talk, we share our lives, we celebrate our inner child. And yes, we obsessively, literally, intentionally just focus on all things positive. That's what we know, it's a joke. Show me these weird ass people. What's going on, Spirit? <laughs> Look, I'm sitting there looking at these people like, I'm about to make me some fried rice with brown rice and green onions, boo, minus the egg. Needless to say, witches and warlocks are campaigning against you. Behind the scenes, shout out to the people that enjoy reading these cards backwards consistently, deliberately. I really do see you as amazing human supernatural alien beings amongst us. So the witches and the warlocks are campaigning against you, okay? So I'm going to come back and do that one. That's going to be the next uh, reading, if you will. Let's just see what these little witches in, in the ditches and graveyards are doing or whatever they're doing. Yeah, somebody's really trying to pull at the energy to see what's going on. You got some skinwalkers out here, some, some werewolves, child. They can hear conversations from a mile away. Somebody's trying to use their clear audience. They're trying to find out what it is that you know, what it is that I know. My ears are ringing. Oh, wow, honey. Oh, close that door. Close it. Get out of here. These people are watching you, though. If somebody's mad that they can't take you down. Child, they used their best arsenal. They called out their biggest demons, and you took their demons and whooped the shit out of them, like, without thinking, without blinking, without having to drink. Somebody's sober, okay? Whatever you did, you did it effortlessly. So the next video, that's going to be what we're going to dive into. But I'm going to get me some fried rice, y'all. I just feel like that's what I want. I love y'all. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, peace be with you.